solar test number something i'll put it on the screen the watch has been outside pretty much since noon no 11 10 a.m so that's 10 12 hours no 19 9 plus yeah 11 hours <laughs> So 11 hours of sunlight being outdoors. Let's there's the lovely Utah mountains. And there's the watch. So I put it in battery saver mode. And 51% 45 days. So now what we have to do is long press. Power it off. Yes. Be right back. Now you might already know this. Even if you charge the Phoenix outdoors for hours and hours, you don't really see the difference in battery percentage until anyone, anyone, a reboot, or in this case, a shutdown. Let's take a look. So now we'll power the Phoenix back on. So we document everything, documented everything on the remarkable tablet. I always get this question. Oh, there's a splash screen. This is the Phoenix 7X Sapphire Solar. So that's power glass on the face of the watch. And then also, so that the entire screen is a solar panel. And then those dark rims around the watch are also solar panels. So now we were at 51, 45 days. And now we're at 53% or 47 days. And if we scroll down, there's our solar intensity, 346K today. Over from 10 a.m. to 1921, yeah, about 11 hours, 10 to 11 hours. Now, on that back deck of my house, yeah, we really only got about four to five hours of sunlight, but still 346K. And then we jumped from 51 to 53 to 45 to 47 days. So two more days of battery life, 53%. So 2% increase in battery life. So if you're outdoors hiking for three hours, if you weren't running GPS, you'd see similar stats, similar. So what do you think? Was that a good test with the Garmin Phoenix? Were you disappointed that it didn't go up more? I mean, that was at least four hours of direct sunlight in battery saver mode, no heart rate, the watch was just sitting there, no movement, and it only went up 2%. So earlier I was talking to a guy online, I think it was Chris, and I was saying it, it kind of goes up 0.75%. It just depends on how much sunlight. Kind of partially cloudy today. So in this case, we went up about half a percent per hour. Eh. So there you go. Thanks for watching. Again, this was solar test number 54 here in Utah County. We'll see you again with another video real soon. Goodbye.